Okay, hello guys, it's uh, TrustGum13 here, and we are finally, this is live by the way, this isn't post commentary, we are finally going to start playing the uh, Call of Duty Black, oh, Black Ops, oh no, <laughs> Call of Duty Advanced Warfare Multiplayer. Now, you're going to see that I already have things, but that's because I played one round, and I'm not kidding, one round. And I already unlocked this stuff, and because I was messing around and looking at my other stuff, you know. And uh, apparently, I unlocked things from completing the campaign. So if I can go into my, uh, oh, what was it? I totally forgot. There's so many things here. Operator is like it lets you customize all your shit, so I can make mine a girl or female. Really, the customization isn't that great, and. My opinion, because I mean, just look at this. There's only 12 faces, and they're all like faces. Some of them are like faces from the campaign. Like, look, Cormac, that's the black sergeant dude from the campaign, and Hades, the terrorist, and then Gideon, your teammate, whatever. And I think this is like the freaking doctor or some shit. I don't know. So, yeah, I picked Davis, whoever the hell this is. Yeah, it's not going to matter since you can't see my face. And then. I'm just saying, but look at the females. There's like no female faces. What's up with that? <laughs> there's like no female faces at all. Like there's a ton of dude faces, yet there's no girl faces. That's kind of weird. And yeah, here I have all my different outfits. I Again, really, I haven't done anything. I've just kind of been meddling with it. I just kind of picked something that looked good for my first round and then I played it. So really, I have barely played. I barely played at all like so I don't know any of the maps. I don't know Any of the other shit, you know On Atlas campaign outfit. That's why it says Atlas campaign Because that's what that stands for because I did I guess I beat the campaign so they gave me all this stuff including the cool helmet Bloodshed I think it's called Then you got different outfits that you can pick and mess around with like Made this other one here real quick. Uh, and yeah, so we're gonna jump in here, I guess you could say. There's all kinds of challenges here. I, again, I don't know. I, I did mess around to create a class. Uh, they brought back the... They basically brought back the pick 10 system from Black Ops, which I love. So I'm, I like that. And we're gonna be rocking it with this one, I think, for a little bit. I don't really like any, I didn't really like any of these other perks, so I, I love about the pick 10 slash, I guess now it is pick 13, you can just, you know, take out perks you don't like and be like, well, I want more grenades, and you put more grenades, you know. And then, also, you can upgrade your, uh, your drones and shit, or, um, uh, Score streaks, yeah, score streaks, not kill streaks, score streaks. Again, this is like Black Ops. So I got care package and I got the remote turret. And in my first round, I'm not kidding either. I was literally at the top of the leaderboard in my first round, and I was like, holy shit. And I was just kind of playing it like regular Call of Duty. I wasn't really doing anything nuts. I wasn't even using the exo ability. I guess I have stem set. I'm not, I think I might want the shield. I'm gonna try to shield, but anyway, yeah. First round for just testing purposes again. Like I said, I was just messing around and I eventually got the turret. I got to store score streak three, and I'm like, oh wow, I already got the, the turret. And it's not the sentry turret like from Black. Um, uh, let me just put this from uh, Modern Warfare Two. It's the. Uh, yeah, it's not a sentry turret. So in order to get a sentry turret, you have to upgrade it or you have to customize it. But the problem is when you customize it, the more points you need in order to get to that. So I'm not sure if I'm ever going to get 750. I can never get any of this other shit where it's like mad high and all that stuff. But, eh. <sighs> but yeah, I'm rocking it with the bow here. There's all kinds of other weapons and stuff. I guess I can go over what all the weapons look like here. 
I don't remember half of these guns from the campaign. Yeah, I remember some. I remember this one. This is a sniper rifle. I remember that one, the TAC. The Sonic shotgun or something like that. This one I remember. That, I think I remember that one too. Don't remember any of those. And, yep, I definitely remember that one. The grenade launcher. Grenade launcher unlocked at Global 22. That's weird. Huh. All right. Put some, you know. Oh, cool. Wow, I, I just looked at this and I'm like, oh, wow. So apparently I can, uh, mess around with the different sites. That's cool. So maybe a uh, triangle or let's do triangle. Triangle seems pretty cool. All right. Oh, you can go to the fire range too. I, I forgot to mention that you can also go to the firing range, and it's, it's this is pretty cool. Like I press, I actually did the firing range. And I pressed the firing range button by mistake. <laughs> I didn't mean to press it at all. And I'm getting my bearings because again, the controls are just slightly different from campaigns. So this is the grenade, which is on a launcher now, instead of you know a of you throwing it and cycling through you have to unlock the grenade that cycles through I, I believe and then I think this one aha this one brings up my shield cool it's not as good as the one from the campaign obviously if you had the one from the campaign it'd be overpowered as fuck okay and also something I noticed is look look to, on the bottom right it's different because now you remember from the campaign it was all holographic and on your gun now it's all you know uh now it's just all uh, on your uh the screen there yeah and also you can jump and all this other shit it doesn't matter if you need the specialist or anything like that so basically you have the assault exo all the time which is good because i like the assault exo as you know and specialist exo basically abilities have been put into you know as things that charge up because now I, I don't think it I think you only use the abilities once per life I don't know but anyway let's get out of here I don't how do you all right there you go okay I think we've messed around enough here so let's uh let's get started let's get started let's find around and see how it does how we do, how we do. Again, I've only played one round, so we'll see how it goes here. <laughs> level nine, I don't know how I got to level nine already, seriously, man. But yeah, just check it out. Check out Advanced Warfare Multiplayer, first session, gameplay. I'm kind of excited and pumped. I love the campaign and I want to experience more. I played a little bit of the multiplayer and I liked it from what I played. So let's see.